Hi guys, I wanted to come on here and give everyone a an update <laughs> because I know it's been a while and I'm sure some of you feel like I kind of left you high and dry. So I want to first apologize for that um, because I probably could have been more communicative about what's been going on with the docuseries Chronically Corrupt. However, I like to make sure that I have all the information before saying anything and I like to make sure I have all my ducks in a row because I, I don't like saying something publicly and then it changing. So um, first and foremost, um, yes, the documentary series is going to continue. There are more episodes and those episodes are done. Um, right now, as it stands, um, I am in the middle of litigation against those involved. And because of that, I am, woo, because of that, sorry, my light, because of that, I am not, um, posting the episodes while we are in litigation. And, um, you know, that, that's just a personal, that's a personal choice. Uh, number one is because of the litigation. Um, you know, it, that can take anywhere from a few months to a few years. So, um, I know I left everyone off on kind of a cliffhanger, but I promise there will be more episodes. Um, the other part of it is, yes, the episodes are done. However, before the lawsuit, I had transferred the rights elsewhere. Um, so I know people have been concerned about, you know, there are different things that can happen with a lawsuit. And at this point, I don't know where it's going to go. We're very early. So could it go to trial? Could it get settled outside of court? I, I don't know that right now. And I may not know for a while. Um, but, you know, before this started, I know there were people concerned that sometimes, you know, um, when two parties come to an agreement, sometimes there's a non-disclosure agreement that could be signed and kind of like never talk about this again sort of deal. Um, which is not the reason why I transferred the rights. Um, the rights transfer was for another reason that I can't uh, currently talk about unrelated to the lawsuit. Um, good stuff, don't worry. Uh, but um, you know, for those of you who are concerned about something like a non-disclosure, preventing future episodes from coming out. Um, you don't need to worry about that because I can only be responsible for myself and what I um, put out there. And since it's already been created um, and transferred elsewhere, there will be more to come is what I'm trying to say. Um, and the third part is I, yes, I am currently keeping the three episodes up as I agreed as a stipulation to the um, to the lawsuit that I would preserve anything that I have publicly posted regarding this whole experience. So, um, and that's something I wholeheartedly agreed to. Um, so I'm, I'm fine with that and I'm happy with that. So they will remain up. Um, and when it comes to the documentary, you know, my whole thing at first was kind of just like making it to cope with the situation, but also making it because I was so desperate for help. I didn't know what to do. I didn't know how to handle something like this, especially as a disabled person with a chronic illness. Um, I'd never dealt with something like this before. And it's a complicated situation and it's a complicated process. And I've been very lucky because of my platform, mostly on TikTok, that I've had so many people and so many organizations that have been willing to help me through this process. And one of the reasons it's important for me to continue the series um, in the future is that I want people to have this information. I want people to know what they can do if something happens to them, because it's not easy to find this information. Um, so you know, the other part of it is because it was kind of, in a way, a cry for help. And, um, you know, now that I have found help, um, now that I've become my own help, I guess, um, with the help of all of you, obviously, couldn't do it alone. 
Um, but now that I have figured out, I should say, um, how to move forward with trying to um, find resolution to this, it um, feels less urgent to put out and have out there. And um, I think that as time went on, it became, you know, more of a proof of concept uh, to maybe later on, this is again before the lawsuit, um, to kind of like pitch places. And over the past year, I have made so many connections with so many really amazing, really reputable people in the entertainment industry um, who have, you know, shown interest in it. And I think that, you know, who knows what the future will bring, right? It, it, it's, it's good for a YouTube documentary, but it's my first time making a documentary and it could certainly be better, um, you know, production quality wise, uh, things of that nature. So, you know, it, maybe it'll be used as a proof of concept for the future. Maybe it'll be made exactly the same, except by a bigger production company. I don't know what the future holds for it, but what I do know is there is a future with it. The rest of it will come out and I will make sure of that. But for now it is on pause. Um, because of the uh, lawsuit. And I really do appreciate everyone's patience. And I know for a while I was kind of like teasing the fourth episode and you know, the more time went on, I was like done with it. And I was working on the others and I was getting the others done and I was really trying to get them all done so I wouldn't have to like keep being like, oh, it's gonna be done in a week. And then be like, oh, it's not done yet because I wasn't feeling well or whatever came up. It eventually just kind of got to like, um, I just felt like I shouldn't post it yet. Um, and then that just kind of bled into me figuring out how to move forward with finding a resolution to this situation. So, um, yeah, I feel like I should have said something sooner <laughs> about it. And I, I know I did on my TikTok and stuff, but I forget that not everyone follows me on TikTok. Um, you know, there are people here that don't follow me on TikTok or, you know, Instagram or whatever. So, you know, that being said, I am going to try to post more content on here. Um, not that documentary series specifically at the moment, but you know, other things, um, like today I did like a live stream while I was like checking out this like creepy abandoned castle, um, little like shorts and stuff that I post on my TikTok that are just like goofy. Um, I'm going to try to be more active on this channel and, you know, I am more active on Instagram than I have been in the past. Um, so follow me on there and follow me on TikTok if you don't already. And I'm also on Snapchat now. I just made a Snapchat, so I will, um, link everything in the description, but I really appreciate everyone's patience because I know I've been seeing so many comments like, what happened? Are there going to be more episodes? And it like sucks to leave everyone on a cliffhanger. <laughs> but I assure you it's for the best. And um, I will keep everyone updated as best as I can. Uh, while still kind of preserving the, um, the privacy of the case. Even though, you know, the case is public. Uh, it, it, you know, it, it's important. It's important for me that it's handled appropriately. And I don't want to, uh, you know, get in the way of the courts or of the judge. I don't want to waste the judge's time. I don't want to waste the time of the defense and their attorneys. I just, I want to make sure that this is done correctly and in the most uh, respectful following protocol way possible. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I love you all. Please stick around because there, there will be more. Where there's going to be more, I don't know. Maybe it'll be on here. Maybe it'll be somewhere else. Like I said, I don't own it anymore. So it can be a number of places. But, uh, you know, where it lives now, those in charge are aware that I'm keeping up the current videos because I agreed to. And at least for the remainder of litigation. And they are also aware that we're not doing anything with this until there is some sort of conclusion to this. Um, 
what that conclusion is, I don't know yet, but uh, there will be more. So anyway, bye.